Good morning, uh, Jay here. <laughs> I just want to take a second to make this quick Sunday morning message because um, I felt it kind of rounds up my the week I've been having. <laughs> okay, that's the best way to put it. All right, you know. Um, let me read it first. It says, things are never as bad as they first seem. Stand back and see things with fresh eyes. There's always a way though. Okay. So, let's go back and break that down. It says, things are never as bad as they first seem. And I'm going to start there because, you know, back in, gosh, it's been back that long. 2.13, July 2.13, I joined the company, okay? Offered everything I believe that I wanted. as a 100% commission for your work, you know, coming from the insurance industry, that's like the top, you, you can't really get more than that, okay? Um, I was wondering how companies paid that out. But anyway, um, so I joined the company, I was on a great team, right? Everything was rolling, you know? Um, then about, oh, let me think. Yeah, yeah, just around, not even five months, five months later. Uh, I'm going to make this a very short story. The, the CEO decided to change directions. I wasn't very happy with it. My sponsor said, hey, and, you know, hang in there for the long haul. We got a great team together. So I said, okay. And anyway, make a long story short. Um, July of this year, of 2014, I ended up um, leaving the organization, okay? And um, I made a snap decision because I went with the team. I tried to, I want, you know, I've always been a team player. I said, hey, I'm gonna go with the team, you know what I mean? And in less than a month, I figured out that that wasn't for me, mainly because of the product they were marketing, it just, it just wasn't my thing. So I found a company, I've always loved informational products, right? And um, say, hey, this is great, you know. Uh, got with some guys from my old team. We put together an awesome uh, group. We're all motivators. We're all hustlers, hard workers, and um, things were starting to look up. <laughs> then all of a sudden, uh, I have to put in there also. I live overseas, okay, and and. Uh, stateside merchant uh, processors, this is people network marketing, what I'm talking about. They have different laws for people live overseas. Anyway, make a long story short, the uh, there were some changes made in that organization, and it kept me from being able to get my money. All right, so therefore, uh, I'm not gonna lie, I was knocked down. I was really, really knocked down. So it says things are never as bad as they first seem. Stand back and see things with fresh eyes. So for a couple of days, I didn't do anything. You know, I just walked around and do, I guess, what most of us do when we're first disappointed. I moped, you know, just head hung down. And, <clears throat> and I know that's not me because I've been a motivator and a fighter all my life. I remember this email I'd gotten from uh, a dear friend of mine that I've known since uh, 2007. Excuse me. <coughs> <coughs> And uh, he had sent me a business offer. And at that time, you know, I'm like this, man. You know, uh, <laughs> I'm one of these guys that believes in, in 50 years of marriage, okay? So when he sent it to me, I was freshly married to my new company. And I said, nah, nah, I'm not interested. I, I'm good. You know, that's what a lot of people say, I'm good. Okay, and I really thought that was good. So I'll be honest about that. So anyway, this that email came back to me. I went back, and this time, I looked at it, as it says here, see things with fresh eyes. I looked at the business offer with fresh eyes. Okay? And I saw things I didn't see the first time because I just glanced over it. I just said, wow, okay. No problem. And I realized that in reality, in the long run, what he was showing me was better than what I was already in. 
Now, understand what I'm saying, okay? Product-wise, product-wise, okay? Because it was something that was in demand. I hate to say this, but as much as I love marketing education, education is not always in demand because people won't open the books, okay? That's, that's just the way it is, all right? Uh, although, as we all know, there's a lot of knowledge inside of the books if you open them up and actually read what's there. Some people are too lazy to even listen to a video, you know, uh, or audio training, which is crazy because knowledge opens doors. And we all know that. So anyway, I sat back and listened to a 30-some minute presentation and it kind of sunk in. And then I went to YouTube and did some digging on my own. Looked at another presentation and... Now, you know, I always find this when CEOs do presentations that they believe me, every CEO believes they're the greatest salesman in the world. They're not. Okay, so CEOs, if you're watching this, let somebody else do a presentation for your company. Don't do a presentation for your own company. They can do it better. Okay. Anyway, uh, the video I found was half as long as the one that I looked at, but it got to the meat. And the meat is always, if I put out my work efforts, what am I going to get paid in the end for my efforts? So in just one part of the program, because the program has, you know, almost 20 different ways you get it paid, but one part of the program, I looked at, and I looked at it with fresh eyes, and bells went off. You know what I mean? And I said, wow. You know, if I really go back, I was really introduced to this over a year ago like this time last year by another friend of mine on Facebook and I said no <laughs> no I was so into the company I was in I had closed my eyes to anything else okay now uh, I made my decision and um, I've been doing my I'm doing my studying right now but I will be making my announcement later on today if not first thing tomorrow morning to let everybody know where I went you know um, so I'm getting to the bottom line. It says there is always a way though. So look folks, if you're going through something, trust me, things are never as bad as they first seem. You, you, you got to back up. You got to step back. I don't care if you, you know, just, uh, <laughs> go watch movies for a day. Just take your mind totally off of whatever the problem is in whatever way you can and then come back and look at it again with fresh eyes. And you will find that there is a solution. There's always a way. Okay? It's like I meet guys, you know, and they're saying, well, I got the best business to get you here to the top. You know, there's plenty of room at the top. And I tell people all the time, we might not all take the same road. But as long as we have the goal to get to the top, we'll meet each other there. All right? So that means that we'll all be vacationing in uh, Cancun or uh, the Côte d'Azur in France, uh, Monaco, wherever. We'll all be there, partying, but we might just be representing other companies. All right? Different roads to the top. But as long as you look at it with fresh eyes, you will find a solution. So I hope someone got something out of today's message. I'm going to leave you with this. Things are never as bad as they first seem. Stand back and see things with fresh eyes. There is always a way, though. Okay? God bless each and every one of you. Hey, be on the lookout for my tape later on today on my New business adventure. I'm so happy and fired up. You just don't know. God bless each and every one of you.